Hey guys, what's up? I'm Eric Surf6. Welcome to Eric Mealtime. And in today's episode, it's going to be Mexican delivery. Yes. Mexican food, Mexican beer, I gotta have a Corona. Corona, you've got to have lime, yes. Lots of lime today, extra lime to kill the virus. There we go, how many is that, three? That should do it. All right, cheers to you guys. I think I put too much lime. Today we've got tacos, we've got burritos, we've got quesadillas, we've got a salad, we've got some side dishes, we have nachos, what else do we have? Carne asada, fries, oh, buffalo wings. Shall we start with the salad? The dressing smells lemony. Lemon fresh. Nice colors, but other than that, it's a pretty basic salad. Uh, cucumber. Oh, I like the red onion in here. That's good. Okay. One bite and we'll move on. Oh! One more bite. I like this dressing. Oh, yeah. It's a creamy citrus dressing. Mm. We have got four different types of tacos here. We've got beans, we've got pan chick, whatever that is. I think it's avocado and chicken. This is the California here with shrimp and then a Mexican taco. Let's start with the beans. So this is gonna be a hard taco, pretty standard. Looks like it needs sauce, doesn't it? Gotta have the guacamole. Is it guacamole or is it guacamole? Going in for the bean taco. Mmm, mmm, mmm. The shell is perfect. There's an awful lot of lettuce in here. Where's the beans? Down at the bottom here. <laughs> There's the beans. That's all you get. <laughs> it's more like a lettuce and salsa taco. Hmm. All right. It's good though. It's very fresh. Next up, let's go for the Mexican taco. This is heavier. Oh wow! This has got all kinds of stuff in it. Look at all that meat. Oh, I'm ten times better than the bean taco. We're gonna bite into this big giant bunch of meat right here. Ready? Is that a jalapeno? Perfect. Cilantro on top. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Good sized taco. Boom. Woo! Oh, it's got some heat. Tasty. Mmm. Oh, it's a smoky meat. Just like in Mexico. Look at that steak. This is fantastic marinated meat. And oh, it is spicy. Mmm. Oh. Delicious. Let's try the California soft taco. This one served open fit. I like this because you can see everything that's in it. It's smothered in cheese. Yeah, it's beautiful. What else is in here? Onions, there's corn. We're in Japan, so it's got to be corn in it. A lot of cheese in it. It's heavy. California. I'm from California. Let's see if this tastes like a California taco. Mm. 
Oh my. Oh, it's all about the cheese. And the shrimp. It's a shrimp and cheese taco. It's pretty tasty. The corn, I don't know. I think I can do without the corn. But other than that, this is delicious. Lots of cheese. All right, this one's called pan chicken. It's got avocado on it. It's got some paprika. It's looking beautiful. Onions. A lot of cheese as well, too. This is heavy. They're all heavy. Make sure we don't eat the paper. It's the same color as the tortilla. <laughs> okay, here we go. Pan chicken. This one's more mellow than the California. Paste the chicken in. I like the avocado in there. <laughs> this next dish is carne asada fries. Where's the fries? <laughs> Plenty of carne asada on top of there. That's looking good. It's like sour cream here. Yep, and they give you some lime to hit it with. Got my own lime right here. Use some of my lime. Try the meat first. Mmm. -hmm. Mmm. Steak like. It is steak. There we go. There's the fries. Need some guacamole and sour cream. Oh, this is the first. <laughs> oh yeah. Gotta have the sour cream in the guacamole. Pretty delicious. These are banging. Yep, definitely banging. This here is a chicken quesadilla. It comes with sauce to dip it into. Right, let's just pick these up. Get that cheese on top. Let's have a look at the inside, shall we? Oh, looking good. Is that squash? That green there it looks like zucchini or squash. Fix her up with some salsa. A little bit of guac. And we're ready to go. Chicken and cheese quesadilla. Oh. I like how the cheese is melted on top of it rather than inside. Interesting way to do it. Yeah. Oh, it's messy. It's like a stuffed Mexican pizza. That's what a quesadilla is. Nicely done. <sighs> this here is an egg burrito. Yeah, let's have a look. A breakfast burrito. And it's got greens in it. What is that? Is that spinach? A lot of green in it. And it comes with the sauce. This is oh, it's ketchup. I guess so, huh? Ketchup for a breakfast burrito. Okay. A little bit of ketchup. Is there some hot sauce as well too? There is. There's habanero sauce. That'll be good. Give it some kick. Kick, 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 kick it up. Kick up the heat. Looking good. It's definitely a lot in it. Big portions. <coughs> oh, it's got corn in it. 
corn and potatoes, and egg, and spinach. No meat. Or trace amounts of meat. It's pretty simple. You know, as breakfast should be. What is that? Spam, maybe. A little bit of spam in there. Is it spam? Is it bacon? It's bacon. Correction, it's bacon. And today's flower arrangement, these are purple petunias. And these here, they don't really have a name. I'm not really sure. We'll just call them Macarenas. These are for the ladies. Since my subscriber base only has about 37% women, we've got to bump that up to 50-50. That'd be good. We've got one more burrito here. This is a beef burrito. Let's take a look at the inside. Oh yeah, it's got rice in it. I don't know how I feel about rice in a burrito, but we're in Japan, so rice kind of makes sense, I suppose. Yeah. So it's got a little bit of guacamole in there already. I'm gonna add, I really like this habanero sauce. When in doubt, add more. A lot of volume here, all this food's got a lot of volume. Definitely gonna gain some weight from today. Oh, beans in here too. Oh. This is the best so far. Steak. Mmm. Oh. This is banging. It was sour cream in here too. This is a good burrito. I think it's black beans. Mmm. All kinds of flavors going on in here. My mouth is on fire from this habanero hot sauce. Corona to the rescue. And you go, that's a big lime. Cheers to you guys once again. You want to spill on the camera. Oh, it's tasty. What do we have here? These, my friends, are nachos. Got to have nachos, Mexican food. Yep, this is a staple, right? Nachos. Like some beans on top of there. The sour cream, got to have that. This is good. Like that. Mm -hmm. Beans and sour cream go together really well. It's all of it. A little bit of everything. <laughs> Magical. So messy and so, so good. Nachos are really fun eats. You just gotta get in there, make a mess, and enjoy. Oh, yeah. Okay, on my rating scale between one and six Eric heads. Wait a minute. We've got buffalo wings. Forgot about the buffalo wings. Look at that. Yes. I love it. We have ranch dressing here, do we? Looks like we do. Not too bad. I like the cucumber. They almost look like pickles, don't they? Are they pickles or are they cucumbers? They're one and the same. It's a pickled cucumber. How about that? Buffalo wings and some sauce. What could be better? Ooh, it's got some spice. Oh, I like these. Buffalo chicken wings for the win. 
Well, let's do another. These are really good. I like the spice. Is that Frank's hot sauce on there? Something. And this dressing is really nice too. It's better than ranch. Oh, these are amazing. Oh, yeah. Mmm. Oh, I can't stop. One more. Can't stop. Can't stop. This is a very secret dressing. I've never had dressing this tangy and delicious before. It's better than your standard blue cheese for sure. Oh, delivery Mexican food. Ah. Ah. Wow, those are good. Those are really, really good. Mm. Really, really good. Today's dessert is something really special. This is coffee jelly. Have you guys ever seen this before? Coffee jelly. My fingers are so greasy I can't get this open. There it is. Meow, 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 meow. Oh yeah, look at that. Coffee, jelly, that's what it is. Let's give it a try. Ooh, that's exactly what it tastes like, coffee. And the sauce is like it's like Cafe au lait. It's a, it's a sweet, creamy sauce. It sounds awful, but it's actually pretty good. It's pretty sweet and creamy. And the Jello has a really strong taste. It just tastes like you're drinking coffee. It's chilled. This is fabulous. It's not Mexican. This is very Japanese. You buy this at the convenience store. Yep. There you go. Just wanted to share that with you. It says sweet cafe on it, and that's exactly what it is. It's a sweet. It's a dessert. You know... <clears throat> So, Mexican food, Mexican beer. Now it is time to rate this meal. It was super, super messy. When food is messy, that's how you know it's good. So on my rating scale, between one and six air cads, I think we're gonna count the napkins up here and we'll see what we've got. There's one, there's two, there's three. There's four, there's five, six. It's a six star ranking, six Eric heads. It's a nom nom nom. That's the top ranking, which means I'm giving away three of my get some snack packs. The only thing you need to do for your chance to win is to put a comment down below and you'll automatically be entered. And I will choose three winners and announce them in the very next Eric meal time. What is a get some snack pack? It is goodies that I assemble myself and put into this box and I send them to you. From Japan. It's really good stuff, handpicked for me. There'll be a link right up here so you can check it out if you'd like to see what's inside. There's a playlist of over 100 people that have opened or unboxed these Get Some Snack Packs. So good luck. I look forward to reading your comment. Give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And as always, I will see you in the next video. As always, I look forward to reading your comments. See you next time. What's up, what's up, wasabi? Hey, congrats on making it all the way to the end screen. Care to hang around a bit more? Click on some of the links on the screen and watch a few more videos. Cheers and beers. Who's thirsty? <laughs>